They're not pretty, they're not fun, and contrary to popular belief, they are not just the domain of old ladies. In fact, growing up as a child in an unheated house, I know all about the miseries of chillblains. Chillblains are painful, often really itchy red lumps that tend to occur when you get exposed to cold on bits of your body that are as far away from your heart as possible, so the bits that have the worst circulation. Obviously, that's hands and feet, but they can affect your earlobes and even your nose. They're more common in children, in old people, and they are more common in women who tend to have worse circulation. But then most men know all about that from the battle for the thermostat. They're also more likely to happen if you have problems with your circulation. So that could include things like peripheral arterial disease, being a smoker, having diabetes, having anorexia, or conditions like lupus. Once they've occurred, they can last for several days, even when you have warmed up. So clearly, avoiding getting cold in the first place is the key. That includes things like making sure you wear gloves and scarves if they affect your face, and making sure that you wear lots of layers so that you can wrap up and wrap down. If you do get very cold though, don't heat up too quickly as that can make chillblains worse. Usually just keeping away from really cold situations is enough to keep chillblains at bay, although you should avoid beta blocker tablets which constrict the blood vessels and can make it worse. If your symptoms are very bad, then tablets which open up your blood vessels can help to reduce the risk although those can drop your blood pressure.